couple things at the top and then we'll get started. I wanted to start today by addressing the announcement by Mexican officials regarding the status of the four Americans attacked in Mexico. We're still working with Mexican officials to learn more and to have all Americans return to the United States. President Biden has been kept updated on this incident. Senior members of the White House has, have also been engaged. We extend our deepest condolences to their families and friends. For the sake of privacy and out of respect to the families, we are going to refrain uh, from further comment about those circumstances at this time. I can confirm that U.S. officials are in touch with the families of the individuals, but again, we will respect their privacy regarding our conversations with them. We appreciate the hard work of the Justice Department and the FBI, DHS, and DEA for their swift response to this awful incident and for their continued collaboration with Mexican authorities. These U.S. agencies remain in close touch with their counterparts, and we expect that they will share more as they can. Attacks on U.S. citizens are unacceptable, no matter where or under what circumstance, circumstances they happen. We will continue to work closely with the Mexican government to ensure justice is done in this case. Since day one of this administration, we have been focused on disrupting transnational criminal organizations, including Mexican drug cartels and human strugglers, smugglers, pardon me. In the past few months, President Biden signed an executive order giving the Department of Treasury expanded authorities to penalize cartel organizations and those who control or enable them. And we have imposed powerful new sanctions against cartel organizations in recent weeks. We remain committed to applying the full weight of our efforts and resources to counter them. Right now, our immediate concerns are for the safe return of our citizens, the health and well-being of those who, who survived this attack, and the support which must be rendered to the families of those who, who, do, who need it. 